judgment. Yebe di asem bi wo radio she say see eh. So whatever you are doing you have to put down your notes now. We are about to listen to a story from JJ Gonami aka the Bokwi hitmaker. Do you understand Bokwi? I know me sell and I'll explain it to you later. <laughs> from the Volta region will be having issues but then this morning we're going to use the space to settle that for your information whatever issue we have on board this morning is between JJ Gonami who is seated right here before me with his manager Ekbe they are all here and against this man Volta regime <laughs> all right so check your time 4 minutes exactly after 9 a.m. 22nd day of August 2019 and um JJ Gonami is here officer welcome to the studio Thank you. Aha chili pao. Ah, how mum dey hatch chili? Um, no crane say your technicians no money be. And tomo my speakers are oh tia as your night club. So. Aha, and you tell me feelings ah no asasa. Now unim dey away empo. Aha, that is the feeling. And I condition is so bo. A bo, a bo, a bo. Pa 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 pa. Air flow for mum my condition is bo. Omo tell me bo ano that drinks ah no unim dey obeka. But still. I hear JJ Gunami there. I know he has some power. <laughs> he has the power of populism. <laughs> Energy. <laughs> <laughs> it is called the power of populism. <laughs> now, can you promise me that everything you say this morning will be the truth, nothing but the truth? Yeah, yeah. Are you sure? Yes, yes. And also, are you aware that Adam might be listening and therefore, if you say anything lies, he's likely to come back to respond to you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Are we going to make it as simple as possible? Our panel members are listening. Those who are outside are also listening. We have been following some disturbing issues between you, Adam, and some one or two people on social media. So many screenshots flying here and there over an issue you're about to tell us well so that we can advise we can also suggest solutions to this and all that. Yes. What is really happening between you and Adam? How did it start? Okay, thank you and greetings to the listeners. My people in the voter region, I greet everybody special. Say that in every way. Mm-hmm. 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 Uh-huh. Now let's listen to the story. Okay, the honest truth is that uh, I like the honest truth. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, y- you know, last give, give him this mic in addition. Give okay, him the, okay, uh, give right. him two microphones. Thank you. Uh, let him feel like he's the president of the republic, <laughs> uh, doing the state of the nation's address. Uh huh. <laughs> Thank good, you. Good. Good. So, uh, the other day I came here, we talked about the Godo song, and you asked me a few questions, but I couldn't answer because yeah, I. I was not having the actual fact to tell you. So, it's all about the uh, Gudu song and the Voice of America interview. Adam got us, Adam got interview and he told us to come and, you know, th- that's the Voice of America interview. So, we went. We went um, and l- let's go back to it. After you guys did, did the, the song. Gudu song. Yes. Voice of America yes. came to Ghana to interview Adam. Adam and us, the, the whole crew. Wait. Yeah. Um, did they call Adam alone for an interview and he extended invitation to you guys because he worked with you? Or they called the whole team? Which one do you know for a fact? Okay, Adam just told us that we should make ready. He has interview like he got America uh, Voice of America interview deal for us, so we should come and he gave us dates and the venue and we went. Okay, where was the interview recorded? Um in Accra. Okay. Yeah. So okay, most yeah. of the guys who were on the Godo song, they are based in the Volta region. Okay, I think. I think. Yeah, some of them. You don't know them. I don't really know their current locations. You know. But you know them. I know them. I know. Them. Okay, so they all came for the interview. The interview. Yeah. Do you remember the month or the year in which this uh, Voice okay, of America I, interview was recorded? I think a year ago. A year ago. So it was last year. Last year. 2018. Yes, please. Okay. Uh huh. You guys came, recorded the interview, and the interview. What, what happened? Uh-huh. And after that, uh, we posted pictures. You know, in the social media, there, if you post something, it go trend, and mm-hmm. the fans wanted to see the video. So they were asking, ah, why it be only picture we go take like them? Why they no go see the video and all that? So I went to the group. 
the group that Adam created for us, for him and uh, we, the six artists from mm-hmm. Volta region. So I went to the group and I asked him, and you know, I asked him just normal, like the fans. This is the uh, this is what the fans were saying. They wanted you. You asked in the group. In the group, yeah. That. Yeah. This is uh, this is what the fans were saying after the interview. They want to. So I was expecting maybe we we'll get a link to share with the fans so that they can watch the interview and. You know they will be okay. So I I came into the group and I asked my brother, uh, and the word that he Wait. used. Yes. Do you remember your exact words you used in asking your brother, as in Adam, uh, what has been the state of the interview? Do you remember your exact words? Okay, I just talk like I'm talking to my senior brother. I cannot. Uh, no, I'm asking that. Do you remember the exact words? If you you have your phone here and the question okay. is still there, maybe you can refer to it. Yeah, that phone got uh, spot long that, time it ago. It got missing. Yeah. Okay, so you don't remember the exact words you used in asking the question. If I say something like that, maybe I might mix something. So, but I just talked to my brother like a big brother, asking him a question, and he threw. What, what, what did you ask? What exactly did you ask? Like the, this is what the fans were saying. They wanted to see the video of the interview because mm-hmm. they thought we are just lying with uh, to them with the pictures on social media and mm-hmm. uh-huh. so i asked him and he, you know he be senior man so the word that he used at me i just take it normal and do you remember the words he used at you yeah he said i should i should stop that nonsense and you know, when you ask that uh, maybe Adam, please uh, the fans are asking when the voice of america interview will be aired or when it will come online for them to also see and Adam came and he just said yeah he said i should go now me stop that nonsense the voice of america and then so me i see that stop that nonsense no i don't even read the rest of the message so i just you know i move you know i just go off the page not that i existed but i i, I just leave that page because i wouldn't want to read and i don't want to comment so i left that one but you know after um, one year hold it hold it the six people among the group members that yes. did the godo song yes at that time what did they also say when you asked that question no they, they didn't say anything none of them said anything yeah after adam comments they, they they didn't say anything so okay now before you asked about your portion of the video had adam's portion been posted or had his portion been aired no me i don't see any of me i'm not i'm not talking about me my portion the, the fans just they, they are requesting to watch the interview no uh, let, let's go back to my question yeah. i'm saying that the fans were asking of your portion of not the my portion they the want, whole yeah they want to watch it be, it be projects we do it be go do song you know be me alone did the song top so the fans say oh why the interview they no go watch them they know they talk say uh, my part of the interview they no go watch them they say the interview so, okay so before that had portions of the interview been published no no i don't N- see nothing at all no no we don't see anything like oh, that oh okay nothing yeah. at all had been published no 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 i don't see anything and the like fans that. were asking you yeah, they were asking me. I mean, you know, say my fans here, yeah, they love me and they want to see me, you know. Mm, so your yeah. fans love you more than the way Adam's fans love him? I oh, guess. no, 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 no. I don't go feel toxic. Me and they talk about my fans. My fans, I know say they love me. So, okay, yeah. okay. All right, so let's continue. And um, you asked and Adam said, uh, Gonami, stop the nonsense. Yeah. And you kept quiet. And what yeah. happened afterwards? Okay, after, you know, after one year, the fans are still asking me. So why are they asking you? Because they know Adam is bigger than you and the interview might have come through him than yeah. you so why are they asking you yeah maybe they cannot go to adam direct he be senior man we, we over the how did they ask you how did they ask you like they keep uh, asking why charlie the he reached one year what's up on like, social media and they on, tag you yeah they nobody tag himself i be people they call me I, yeah. I, they, people feel call me from the fans there some of them they know plenty of them know my number mm. so then if they call me and oh good name what's up the interview we know they watch you. We know go we'll watch some at least, uh-huh. because they know say Voice of America platform will be big, and yeah. you know they see the my artist JJ Gonami on that platform. It be they be happy already, so they just want to see the video and you know be happy okay. and share it. Okay. So, so he said after uh, the stop the nonsense. When, after one year, something happened. Uh, that was yeah, when he got to yeah. That that was when the first keep uh, asking me and. 
I went on Facebook because I don't want to call my brother again. Maybe he could give me another one. So mm-hmm. I, I went on Facebook just to tell the fans what is, I, I want to post something. And I, I went to post something. I said something like, so today my eyes never see the, the Voice of America interview. So I think my uh, big brother, Adam, has some question, uh, answers to this. You understand? And that's the only thing I post. And that, I don't know how I phrase it or the com the post i don't know maybe the the people misunderstood what i posted and they started bashing me and adam came in he post you know he writes a lot of things and i think he just misunderstood what i posted maybe if it be harsher you know like if be my senior brother i go for Call it, well, but tell them say, oh, it be harsh. I think your boy post there, then he immediately go tell me say, delete that post first. But the way he go on Facebook, where he go talk say, yeah, he go talk so many things, and he misunderstood me. I was like, oh, my senior brother, you know, you know like these things, personal things, you know, if I no come on social media, you know, because he posted a lot of things and. He did that for me, me and a quick come back down for money, for my skin disease, where it be lie, you know, he posted, like, he talked so many things, I, I, I came to beg him to go and beg some big man to sponsor me, and all those things, you know, some of them, it be, it no be true, and my big brother, you know, and you know, say, it no be true. So how come after one year, um, when you posted the first one or when you asked the first one uh, on the WhatsApp platform that he said nonsense and after one year, why didn't you use another venue? Because the first one was through WhatsApp, social media platform. He wasn't happy. Then you came to um, Facebook, which is to a wider reach. At least the WhatsApp was just among the seven of you, the six uh, featured artists and Adam himself. Now he came on social media, uh, Facebook, which is like worldwide and anyone at all could see. Uh, don't you also think your approach was in the best way? Yeah, I for for me to me, you know. Later, I think about the whole thing. But me, uh, honestly, I I think I thought maybe if I ask him again, that one he could give me. You, help you know his house. Yeah, uh, yeah, I know his house. Why didn't you and Ekpe, your manager, drive to his house one day? To ask yeah. this um, Voice of Africa, uh, Voice of America interview. Yeah, but all I want to say, see, Eden be my big brother. Mm-hmm. I know we we'll make we drag this issue. Mm-hmm. If my senior brother, we are the respect and too much. Mm-hmm. And where are they right now? It be me now. It be now. I they start this my whole career. And I just want to say, I'm big sorry because you know sometimes me I no be perfect. Sometimes I might think some uh, or take some decisions where, you know, it be it be wrong. But me to me, it be it be say I no one call him, ask him again. Then go go give me. So I for tell my fans what is going on. So say then go then go ask me again because as then see him for Facebook. Oh okay, now the video okay. It be the chairman go answer. So me I feel like oh ask. After I post that thing, Adam will come and comment. Oh, go now the video. They are still editing it, or they will post it later. I'll send you a link to share with your fans. That was what I was expecting, but I wasn't expecting that comment from him. That got me, you know, emotionally, you know, and you know, I uh, the whole thing started. But I'm sorry. I'm sorry for everything, you know. Okay. Now l- let's come back to it once again. Are you saying that Adam's response to you got you irritated, as in he talked? about some things you were not expecting him to have talked about in his post yes yes uh, which you think they were all lies yes 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 that you had some sk- skin, skin disease. disease yes it, it was because the day you know the day to the interview i think at a point he even said you were sent to the police station and uh-huh. he to- all those things you see uh those things be personal things where i know go feel no edem in secret b or something then i can't post them online see make mm. people read them because you know a day before what, the what took you to the police station at that time oh it be some misunderstanding where they invite me but later we cancel that you then someone fight oh it be, it be personal thing but you know be fight me i know the fight oh be, okay be so misunderstanding between you and who yeah it'd be, it be personal thing like yeah okay. yeah okay. but it no be anything big yeah. okay yeah. so adam came to save you uh, from the police station no he didn't come he, he just advised me on phone that's all 
I see. All right. Mm. So, uh, you know, uh, a day before the Voice of America interview, I was having this kind of this malaria. So I went to Ekpe. I went to Ekpe, and you know, the money he was having, he used, he bought me some couple of things, but then I wasn't having enough money to buy the whole medicine that I was supposed to buy. So I told him. And he said, oh, I'll be tomorrow be the interview, Voice of America interview. And if you know Goa, it will worry your big brother. Because all the guys will come and you alone, you know go. So why can't you call him? So there now I say, okay, cool. We are call him. We are tell him about it. Say, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm sick. I get some malaria and this is, I want some, I need something small to buy medicine. Where he send me 100 Ghana cities. Mm-hmm. You understand so i know i expect them to post that and say me and ekpe come back and because that day ekpe no call him ekpe just give me idea and i call him to help me out so that medicine i use that energy to, for the interview so it, it wasn't even after i bought the uh, the medicine i took a picture and sent to adam and i thank him so much for helping me get the medicine that day it wasn't aquabam or any Kusa Kusa medicine. So it be it be that one where he can't talk later for in war say uh it gets skin disease where me then we can beg you for money. It was wrong and you know I, I didn't help me. He did a song for me for free. Yeah I know. Yeah, he did a he sacrificed he do we have three songs now, yeah, it'd be cool. Mm-hmm. But then me and Ogofi come out, can't talk say this is what I do for Adam. Because God knew in my heart, say, okay, at the point of, point of uh, this time, you help your brother, and he be help. Everybody, they help somebody. But if you help me, and later you can't post them on social media, where things no be true, say, we can't talk, say, we can't beg you for money, for my skin disease. Me and Sisla can't beg you to go beg somebody, make you sponsor me. You know that one, you know do them. You know go beg the big man. So, yet. You know go beg them yet. So, you know for post them on social media say we can't beg you to go ahead i see all those things where i see say oh my chairman this one there like uh-huh, but i'm sorry i'm sorry beyond the top so what, what what is the um friendship between you and adam at the moment like um are you guys cool or are you guys are at loggerheads with each other i think i, I should just we should just go to his house and meet him personally because i want to see him and tell him sorry yeah mm. i just wanted to so talk. you've regretted your actions oh yeah 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 mm. because you know it it take a man to say sorry mm. and uh-huh. if you do something where well, you see say no this thing yeah make a coin charm or now this the, thing the rest of the six people what are they saying ever since the give and take between you and adam started what are they also saying Oh, mm, 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 yeah, I see people bashing me. They are they all bashing me. They do it. The, some, the, the, no, it not be the people on the Godo song, but uh-huh. I see yeah, some of the, yeah, because they misunderstood what I mm. posted. So, so is it affecting you any, in any way because most of the fans are bashing you? Oh, no, no. You see, my fans there, then they know see me, I get good music and I will give them good music. That's the only thing they want. So as I'm, uh, I'm alive to give them the good music, they will, you know, they will, ha- they will be happy. So I just want to say sorry, you know, this thing, make you no know, drag him too much. And then with my senior brother, mm. and he get the voice. If I did hear the shout, I did over shout. Nobody go hear me. Me, I no get fans. I no get fans yet. Ghana, it be now before Ghana go can no JJ go now me. And them did it. So I give him all the respect you know much so respect. are you worried at the moment because adam is not in good times with you are you worried oh you know say when matter come there it be more now than the tiktok come so no, i'm asking are you worried oh mm, somehow yeah. Mm, yeah it is disturbing you yeah and that is why you want to use this platform to apologize to Adam. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. he forgets everything and you guys come back to normal. Yeah, and do because the shame video for shoot that video. You and, you and him have a song called uh, shame. shame. Yeah, shame. Mm. Yeah, so for work on that video, that be the song where I always tell him, say, yeah, mm. the video, and I won't make it happen. So the, the Voice of America interview, yeah. have you seen it show anywhere? No, no, not at all. Including Adam's portion of the interview? 
No, I know. Because if I so, see so, 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 so download why, them and why, why is JJ gonna be in a rush to see the interview when even the big man himself hasn't seen it? Chairman hasn't seen it. Okay, me it be the pressure from the fans, so it be make I go ask this thing because they see say it be big platform where they see them are artists on and they be happy. Even if that day I post the picture, plenty likes. They were happy because they see me for bigger platform and now they don't watch the video. That be why they make worried. His name is JJ Gonami. Uh, the song is called Becky. Uh, my producers are still trying to reach um, Adam. Uh, let's see what Adam's response will be. But before that, in the studio, um, Kobiche is still here. Arnold Mesa Levanyo, Dada Havko. And uh, of course, I also see my man Jibreo and Professor Mike Yamua. Let me come to them. Like I said, we are about to do some judgment. I only wish we got Adam before them talking. But uh, my producer tells me Adam is still. Uh, maybe uh, he's babysitting or something. <laughs> Mr. Che. Mr. Ba. <laughs> JJ Gonami. Yanka Den Channel. Na Yanka Den Sunche. Edem. Go get them. Yes, so I think that I understand uh, his frustration and where he's coming from. Mm -hmm. Even with that, anytime we um, host up and coming artists, mm -hmm. and even yourself, you know the pressure they mount on us. Oh, Kobe, you don't be ready to be. Last time, you don't be ready to be. And so it is because, of, or the fact that I mean the excitement. Oh, no, Kobiche news so, and I said more some flex TV so. So that alone, I won't blame him, because what of voice and Voice of America is a very big platform. In the way traffic channel, all the other two the here, obviously. So any fans crying in the bush and will be looking forward to watching. I mean the video. In the other day, I think it was right from his point. Say, I mean requesting the video. I know dear, I really but, understand. But I then I know no quite premium because now nah, all along I thought say maybe I really see interview, you know, I really see a them portion. I don't know the my head, then he could be agitated. But the whole interview you no know, shame my you. I don't know how many times he kept asking. Uh, no, I'm sure he was asking. Because sure for Adam to just asking. come and say uh, <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. But I mean, boss, how many times can I be signed? Oh, that day I ask and we give me. No, I know how some. The way you go, face only, only just like once. Yeah, because I feel like that. You see, some worst day if you hear him, you know, we we'll go back again. <laughs> Like it will cool down. So. Uh, maybe the language you also use, the tone, the tonation, yes. Uh -huh. uh, yes so like no, me I no ask. Oh, uh, you see, me I no go feel disrespected them by sending him harsh message. No, ah, oh, be my chairman. So as just ask him like a, a younger brother asking the other brother question. So. And Agbeshi, all the guys were in the group. They can't say I came. Oh, so Agbeshi was in the group. Everybody, Kini Eyes. Mr. Okay. Massive, get Agbeshi for me. Uh, get mm -hmm. Kini Eyes. Any but one you can get. Uh, if you are not getting them, get any of them for me. Let's see uh, what our next angle we can add to this. Sure. Yeah. So I think mm -hmm. one of the mistakes that he also did from his side was that because it was a group, Nanka so Muni Naba together to represent the group. So, okay, so on behalf of my people, we are asking. But who oh, as individual, nobody will be separate. I did not create a group, and I won't come. I will be such a question, you know. So I think so if I wish like Munina Mumba with one month piece, okay. So Mister them and I bred them. We, I mean, up and coming artists are with each other, you know. The band and Sebeka video, you know. And then it makes sense. But if I won't come, you will know. Then you are sell out. I don't know Munina Munch and a video number. And so one day I think so. I think I say, oh, comes out to guys, you know. Then you you present the thing as the group. What I say? That is one. Now secondly, for Adam to also say say. Or ban or beji scan a inenim or or yare ne sanemano. Those sanemano. details, no. Mm. Those details, I think it was it was wrong. I too think much information. Too much, too much information. Mm. I mean, we're all trying to, I mean, help up and coming artists. This will be yare ne sanemano. Or ban channel beji sabi tends to describe it to a draw. That's an issue about. I mean, you don't go don't out go for. I mean, yes, that mm. extreme on on point such information on social media. Mm. And I mean, this is a question to everyone out there. Or we ban channel or be I mean, with that details or yare ne sanemano. You don't, you don't put. Information out if there's an issue. So maybe this bra, man irritated him so much. To that extent, Ras, I mean, I'm sure say I know individual it, it, it comes to play, but I'm not sure say my bow budget tens is a quarter watch here and I'm not issue. Now say oh address on social media. Mm -hmm. You 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 social media cramenko. In fact, oh. the last thing I'll do is to have an issue with someone and go on social media. That is wrong. No. And for, I, I really respect that so much. Uhuna. Uhuna show no. Obetu mkwadi edrogu insuma mamuano. Yes, obetu megu enimasi. Ah. Actually, we are saying. 
And yet, in certain things, we are Mister Dem. One year, dear. Kobiche, nice conclusion there. Now, JJ Gudami, let me come back to you. Uh, as much as we're on radio, you know, so many issues will come up of this interview. Do you know a gentleman called X Doggy? X Doggy, yeah. I Who know. is he? He be, uh, I, I think he be chairman for Voter Music Awards. He is the chairman for Voter yeah, Music yeah, Awards. He told me personally before, yeah. Okay, now I have this message from him. He's yeah. saying that, good morning, Sammy. Yeah. This is X Doggy. CEO of Voter Music Awards. Kindly ask Gonami. He said Adam is very greedy and doesn't want other artists' progress in the region. Can he elaborate on that? And again, he also spoke about VG, uh, VMA, that is Volta Music Awards, sabotaging him. Can he also speak to that fact? And again, you also did a diss song to Adam. What about that? Did you do all this? That song will be advice song for everybody. I don't mention anybody in name for that song inside. That song will be general song I do. You did an advice song to Adam? No, in, hey, uh, for so everybody. Mm-hmm. For like, it be song we are released, a new single. And, and, and it was at the time that you were having issues with him? Yeah, but I have to drop songs because, <laughs> yeah, it know be beef song, but it be for, it be a song we are do from my heart, a good song for my fans. Mm-hmm. And I name him Akple. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, that be all. The song was called Akple? Yes. So what was the advice? What exactly was the advice? Oh, me, I just they talk for the song inside. People, we, yeah, they, they, they get food where they want your pamelo and things. Make, mm-hmm. yeah, mm-hmm. it be, it be, it be be a song, a good song we are released, so you know, be for uh, I don't mention anybody in him uh-huh, for inside. Did he also say, or did you label them as uh, being greedy? Yeah, in his uh, some some of the things, and uh, it be on the talk, say, I'm sorry, because if I won't talk about the whole thing, uh, we could talk uh, till tomorrow. So, uh, all at the talk, be say, I'm not perfect, we all we they do wrong all the time. You know, and God, we they offend God every day, and we they ask for forgiveness. So I just I I, 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 I talk saying all the things will happen. I'm sorry. Okay. Agbashi, good morning. Yes, sir, Mr. Flex. Mm, big man, how are you doing today? Well, I died yesterday. I had a long night, so um, I just woke up actually. Yeah. I see. Um, sorry, this was not. Uh, you were not informed earlier about this interview but thank you so much for responding to us because of time um we have here with us in the studio jj gonami and as a matter of fact we are talking about an issue on a song called uh godo where voice of america came to interview you guys on the song and uh, jj gonami has been asking about the, the interview and i hear on a platform that you are part of he asked this question humbly and with respect but adam said uh, Take your nonsense away. Don't ask me about this video again. Uh, is it true that happened? Uh, well, um, I can't believe that. But first of all, let me say good morning to your listeners. Uh, mm-hmm. And then everybody who is tuning right now. Um, for the project, the Good Good project was a project that I personally was uh, appointed to summon all the um, voter region rappers and then so on to make sure we, I mean, execute that project. And I quite remember so well that when we released the song, I think it, it's been like a year now, and um, Adam had the um, the Voice of America or so on to, I mean, come to interview us. I mean, when he was aired, I mean, what I realized was that most of us was not, um, I don't know, but I think most of us was not close to the um, DSTV kind of thing because I personally, I didn't watch it or I didn't listen to it. But um, I was um, um, somebody um, I, I, I should, Hold it, hold it. Are you saying yeah. the interview has been aired? Yeah, it was aired. I had, I had a feedback from a fan who okay. called me that it was aired. But then um, I think I didn't watch it or I didn't see it. But uh-huh. it was from a fan who told me that, okay, I heard this, I said, I saw that, blah, 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 blah. But I don't think my other brothers also saw it either. Mm. I hope you are coming from. Okay. So okay. Maybe it could be that maybe um, Konami didn't um, see it or hear it or nobody gave him a feedback. But then um, uh, apparently he wanted a feedback to that. And uh, I think the whole vibe with the communication to Adam or however he felt. I mean, sometimes you can have issues, but then how you approach it might, you know, turn the whole table around. So uh, for me, that's what I can say or I'm saying about this whole vibe. But mm. if I should speak for myself, I was 
updated or I got the feedback the interview was aired. I see. Uh, so whilst you were told that the interview was aired but you were also not in it, uh, were you disturbed? Mm. Were you bothered in a way? No. I mean, I, I was not because it's for me, as I believe I should speak for myself, I have a whole lot ahead of me that I, I'm dealing with. So, I mean, a mere interview or um, interview alone shouldn't stop what, whatsoever I have to because there's a whole lot for me to deal with, not only interview. Mm. And and, and 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 did 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 you take the pains or the time to ask them how come the interview was aired but you guys were not featured in it? Um, in respective respective or whatsoever that we have as in project or whatsoever we're doing, mind you, everybody have his or way of dealing with each or I mean doing things. And them has his way and it's respected. You know, because for what I know about that very interview that we had with uh, the, the, the the crew of um, how you got the viewer or whatsoever, it was Adam's thought and he has to you know keep us in because he feel the the world have to hear us, you know. And I respect that movement from him. So okay. I mean, if um, quote unquote after that, I mean he was Ed or was not Ed, I have played my part as an artist and be there as a. I'm supposed to be there for a senior brother. So, mm. therefore, the rest is to the world. You know, what I hear so long is to the world. Okay. Agbashi, thank you so much for talking to us. We appreciate your response. I'm, I'm very humble. So All right. Thank you so much. So, you heard it from uh, Agbashi, who is also on the project that has brought us this far called the Godo Project. Sega, do you have that, that song? Uh, yeah, if you have it, look for it and uh, let uh, my Kiamua listen to it. Yes. Um, <laughs> um, <laughs> that I have to go. Get through it. Get through it. Get through it. Let me listen to you. Mm, yes, sir. As one, mm-hmm. one of the things that has destroyed groups and movements has always been my fans wants this. My fans want this. You see, it is not easy as an establishing established artist putting another artist on. It is not easy at all because most established artists didn't get that. You understand? And they are not under any obligation to put different artists on. So when somebody push you on and you go about it this way, the person will be peeved. First of all, the interview had not been seen aired anywhere. No, now Agbashi has confirmed uh, someone has told yeah. him the interview has been aired. I would I would have come there. Okay. Mm. According to Gunami, he had not seen or heard it being aired anywhere. So what was the force about forcing at them to have it? Indeed, was, was he having it? Was Adam having it for real? What was he keeping it for? If he had it and he, he Adam had not posted it himself, he himself had not posted it. And he was preventing anyone from posting it because Adam wants to be popular to his, only his wife and his children. Because maybe Gonami thought Adam was being greedy. That's what I'm saying. So Adam wanted to be, Adam wants to be famous to his, only his wife and his children. Because he himself had not posted it. If he had it. Sammy, Voice of America is such a big platform. No artist would have a footage of it. I interview it and keep it in the room. Why was Adam keeping it? So the question is, was he having the footage? If a TV station comes to interview me today, are they going to give me the footage today? Are they going to give it to me? No. They interview and they go. So you'll be expecting that. And even they decide, first of all, when to publish it. Exactly. Which portion to publish. Exactly. How many minutes and all that. Exactly. So all you do is sit on the fence and wait for it to be published. And then when it gets published, probably they're going to tag you in there or something. And if they don't tag you, you could go look for the video and then you download it. As we speak now, if VOA had published the interview anywhere on the internet, it should be found. So if we can't find it still on the internet, then it means it had not been published. So why are we in a rush to look for the footage? If Adam has the footage, the fans are worrying him. Come on. They were really disturbing Sammy, him. 
they were see, calling him, testing him, you, tagging him. You see, me, the fans who. Sorry, listen, me. Mm-hmm. I have never benefited from being carried by a big artist and pushing me out there. If I did, I'll be bigger than today. A lot of artists have had that opportunity and they took advantage of it. Whenever you are an artist and you get being held by a bigger artist, you need to be humble. You need to be humble. Because when a bigger artist holds you, it affects you. Worldwide, MNM to 50 Cent, Dr. Dre to MNM, even here, so I called here to Aquabua, so I called here to Strongman. You can't tell me that all these people have not been, everybody, they may have their issues, but they've all benefited one way or the other. So, as an artist, if you are being held by a big art artist, just chill, relax, and turn us, huh? The fans want this. How? Fans, normal way, where are they? Where, where are they asking those questions? How many are they? Did they come in a group? Or you post something and somebody comes and write? Don't listen to the fans, oh. If you listen to them, you always be making a mistake. It's like you're working with your boss. Just be cool with your boss. Because he can unmake or make you. A call from him could sabotage you everywhere. And you push and push and push and push. It wouldn't go. This is our industry. People do that. You understand? So, for me, I am happy that he has, you know, changed. Apologize. Yes, apologize and said that. Mm. It will be better. Because yesterday I saw a post from Adam mm-hmm. on, on Facebook. And he was advising upcoming artists. When I saw it, I did not know about this story. But inside me, I said that, ah, me sure that somebody must have pushed him to, to, to put up that post. So, if you're an artist and you are being held by a bigger artist, Charlie, relax it. So, the fans want me. The fans want to hear me. The fans want this. The fans want this. No, Charlie, if the fans really indeed want something huge from you, you should be bigger than you are. You should mm-hmm. be bigger than you are because you are in the building process mm-hmm. and try and mix the mortar and the cement and all those things properly mm-hmm. before you start plastering. Mm-hmm. Else, Sammy, you go go and do Nigeria Sansa no good. <laughs> but now they're missing a winning. So for me, I'm happy he has apologized, but mm-hmm. he should be careful because now, now how are you going to win Adam's trust back again? Mm-hmm. How? He might not uh, overcome catch and say, Oh, me pacho, oh yeah, cool, everything. But he's not minding you again. Mm-hmm. And then your career comes back to first grade. You mm-hmm. understand? So for me, to all upcoming artists out there, relax. When you get hooked up by a bigger artist and he's carrying you up and down, your patience. Mm-hmm. People don't know that. When we came out, we used to go and sit at our Pietus and our past seven and record tomorrow morning. Seven. Mm. Yes. We used to go to our Pietus, come to the studio, seven o'clock today. We get there, seven o'clock, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, one, two, <laughs> till tomorrow morning before we record. And even that one, when you get a chance to lay your vocals, it's going to take one month before the song is going to get mixed. Mm. Sammy? Mm. Mm. Patience. Patience. A lot of people have been through a lot. But people don't say it. People have mm-hmm. served of Ram Ponsa them served Lumba. People served masters. The things that the negative that comes out of it is Sammy Yen Kao. We only mm-hmm. highlight the positives okay. because they give you a platform, they give you a start, mm. they give you a button to push. And so all upcoming artists, you should put this thing in your coconut. Okay. Um, try to look for that advice you said Adam gave to uh, up and coming artists for me. I, w- I would want to read it. Um, I'm trying to look for it. I'm trying to look for it. Um, who, who is taking a seat? Who is taking a seat? Bra, you see me. Bra, you see uh, Then I'm so back so far. Mm. So, Wapacho. Aha, uh-huh, Wapacho. Uh, wapacho. I see. I see. Okay. Hey, there's an enemy, no, because uh, back and forth. Back but Yemen advice. Okay, me man advice. Wapacho ne. Wapacho ne. Me man advice. Yemen advice. Yes. JJ Gunami, don't do that again. Mm. Don't do that again. You you need to be patient, and any be beyond the other bedroom. You know that that's one mistake a lot of you you make. You think if you have an issue, the first thing to do is to get out there and start talking. Especially when they think they are dealing with somebody who. Who is now coming? Why? Okay. Thank you so much, Brian Zimi. Um, uh, Ekber would want to say something. Okay, so Hafko has given me the post from Adam, and um, I want to read it. Um, yesterday at 15:27, that is 3:27, um, Adam wrote, "Dear upcoming brothers, we were over 200 in Hammers Boot Camp. 16 made it to the compilation." 
I am the only one hammer produced. The reason I am special is because from 2003 to 2009, I was always with him in good and bad times, and I am grateful to him from 2003 till now. The secret to making it is being grateful to whoever helped you, no matter how small their contribution. Be grateful today and see the results. Hashtag Bevu Nation. Hashtag VRMG. Hashtag Togbi Cha or whatever. Hashtag Global Mind. Thank you. That I have cool. I think really uh, this is what you were talking about. Mm. Um, Jabril. Hey, mm. what? Uh, okay, Ekpe wants to say something. Okay, let's listen to Ekpe. Yeah. Um, I want to greet all the listeners and um, mm. everybody for Volta Region, mm-hmm. all the media houses for Volta Region. Mm-hmm. Um, first I, of all, are you greeting them too? Oh yeah, at them. Okay. I greeted them. You know, mm. the whole issue will be some way. Eh? Mm-hmm. You see, the night before, at them call me. Uh, the night talked, before the interview. The night before, Adam puts the thing on social media about Gunami, whatever, whatever. Uh-huh, he uh-huh. called me, uh-huh. where he talked to me like a brother, cool, say, oh, this be what my boy did do, and he feels say, you know, be right, like how they approach things. So, I think that next day, I for organize some parties like that. So I say, oh, okay, I'll get back to you. But now, no, no, say, Adam go right for Facebook, those things, yeah. But you see, later I sit down and Adam, my friend. Moku put everything aside, you know. Let them help Water Music a lot. Hmm. I've quite remember a cast some time. I think Water Music, they come like nobody really they hear for no artist for Water. It be my own brother. I be at them who make Water Music stand. And me they them all we go for the same camp. That be the last two camp. And we all when a senior brother man be hammer. We all pass through the same teaching. So gonna be go be witness. As the thing goes, you see, say when matter happen, feelings they feel knock. You know, you, you tell this person say this person say this, and you go feel have some few things. But as a wise manager, and as a friend to Adam to, I tell him say yo, see, uh, uh, put yourself, I put myself in Adam in shoes. You they take me like apologize. So I think come back on radio, and make the whole water region know say it be good music where you want give them. You be young and upcoming artists. You need fans. This is not the time you for lose fans because Adam build a brand already. Adam do a lot, and if you do that, you go feel worry your career some more. And he, you know, he take he understood me like how a manager they talk to artists. So I, I want to use this platform, uh, Xylophone FM, talk to the whole Ghana, especially the Volta region, all the media houses, all the chiefs, the elders, anybody who do full entertainment. Say on behalf of me, a credit manager, and. Aborigines promotion, we'd be very, very, very sorry for any word, any bad word Gunami use, any attack okay. on social media, anything. We'd be very, very mm-hmm. sorry. And mm-hmm. to Adam himself, at the time I'm saying, I'd be sorry. And he gave my respect every day, and it never will happen again. So make they forgive us. Nice one. Let me ask you this um, between Stone Boy and Adam, who has been very helpful to voter musicians and their artists? Um, you know this question be tricky small, but to me I would take give I be Adam because take yeah because Stone Boy in own we make like generally be a boy but he no really represent a way. Mm-hmm. He be what uh, I be Adam when he come out show your face say you I be I be Adam water like he start project that thing. Mm-hmm. Stone Boy they know say be a boy who they mm-hmm. do good music mm-hmm. and they represent. So when they come that side to me I would take give I be Adam. Okay, thank you, Ekpe. And yeah. I believe Adam and his team, they are also listening and at the right time, they might respond. Yes, Jabril. Mm-hmm. Um JJ, I would, if you are here, apologize. And I would, add, I would advise you go on social media, wherever you've made any post, take it down. Mm. Since you are sorry for whatever uh, you, you, you've said or done. Um, I want to ask... When you were doing the Voice of Africa interview, did they America? Uh, America, sorry. Mm-hmm. Did they give you a caution not to take content out as a, as in pictures or videos during the interview? Did they oh, no. caution you? But um, but okay, since they didn't. But let me tell you, things like this, um, when you are in such projects, mostly it's advisable to keep the content to yourself mm-hmm. until the main one is out before mm-hmm. you can. Uh, uh, say it. Uh, you can say yeah. things, things uh, uh, put things out there because immediately you put just as you kept pictures out there, people are expecting a lot. Mm-hmm. And here is the case: it didn't come. come. 
and so they get to ask questions ah were you excuse were you fooling us or what you get it so you have to be a little bit patient when you're on projects like this if it doesn't come out because productions like voice of america is huge and it has to go through a series of editors before it will come out one editor can just say no it shouldn't go out and it doesn't matter if even Adam is on it they can kick it aside and you have already told your fa- your people that you are doing it's something like it, and yeah. they are expecting much so you have to be a little bit careful yeah. one thing brass i mean i've been preaching these days is that the new crop of artists we they need coaching mm-hmm. in terms of interviews yes yeah, yeah, yeah. they need coaching mm-hmm. and uh, you have to um get a team that can put you on the lighter uh, 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 brighter side okay mm-hmm. so Think nice for apologizing is a good, good job. Okay. Go delete all the posts mm. and try as much as possible to stay mm. in good. I would, I would suggest that from here, you go to where Adam is okay. and then talk to him. Great, so great. I mean, the ghkasa.com. Gabriel, yeah, yeah. Professor, come and uh, wrap up the whole thing for me. Good morning to you, Arnold Weyla. <laughs> Weyla, the Rasta man. Bucky, 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 Bucky. All right, so Bucky is coming from JJ Gonami. Okay. JJ Gonami, your name is sweet, too, you know so. <laughs> yeah, that your name is sweet, wa. JJ Gonami. Yeah. All right, yeah, yeah. Prof. So, mm. I, I think the little piece of advice that I've gone to him. I think they, they've taken it and we are beginning to understand the whole editorial policy <laughs> around even interviewing. This wasn't as if it was a video shoot. Or maybe probably they even understood it that it was a video shoot where they go and edit and come and air it. But this is purely a news item documentary and yes, as Agbeshi said, it's been aired. So maybe it's up to them possibly maybe to also request for the a footage of it. And they can share that if he doesn't have it. But you know, the, the larger issue is that you know we, we are in a small industry where it becomes virtually it's, it's a bad thing to pick on established arts in public. That's not to say that if they are doing something that is not right, you shouldn't <laughs> air your frustration. But of course, you stand to lose because you say, Look, you can never fight with an elephant. <laughs> Okay, you can't. Even if you have a kiss, he has a bigger following. He has bigger leverage in the media. <laughs> and even opportunities to even people who, even investors. And it can invariably uh, affect, affect your brand. Yeah. Yeah. So, yes, some of these things, you leverage on it, you take your time. and then, But it's good they are learning the hard way. Mm-hmm. And that's mm-hmm. also not true. Not just for the artists, but even their managers and even their publicists. Some, sometimes I sit back and I get sudden. For example, when Sarkodie was recording this year, BB bar mm-hmm, thing, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Some, we all can attest to the, the kind of benefit some of the artists on it today, they, they, they've enjoying. gotten, they're mm-hmm. enjoying, mm-hmm. even if it's no monetary. And where is even Jibril? <laughs> yeah, his boy, yes. Kwame Dami. He's got an opportunity to even more or less manage or, yes, one of them, frequency. But sometimes he will sit on social media as an artist and then <laughs> you get to be taking a dick at somebody who is giving some giving your artist what an opportunity. Who will do that? Um Jibu. And he's not the only person. I'm just using him because okay. he's here. Mm. I'll tell him in his face. Mm. And on social I went that way and it's happening a lot. Mm. Okay, we begin to pollute. But people. J- J- uh, is not Kwame Dami. He's not frequency. He's not frequency, but uh-huh. you are affiliated to the artist. You promote him. So if he feels something about Sarkodie, because Sarkodie has put uh, frequency on a song before, he, he shouldn't say it. Is that what you mean? You you need to say it, but how you say it? And when, when you do that and it's continuous, then it's as if either the boy is pained, you get it, for probably not getting something from the artist. Then based on that, he's using you as an influencer to what? Get him down. Okay. You get, and these things happen. People read between the lines. People read between the lines. Lord, you know, literally, they'll come at me. This what? Can you analyze, test it, put it like yes. So that I'll go and then. So let's all learn from these <laughs> issues. And then if we have issues, real issues, uh-huh. bring it to the fore. Okay. Okay, bring it to the fore. Let industry people what, interrogate it and know how it goes. But you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. But today they no make fine. You know, say, but energy, they change. You be like, ah, gamma. 
see thank you so much let me have your final message before you leave me mm. yeah i i want to thank uh, all of you for the advices and i i i want to you know brass i mean you know the campaign where they go on right now for voter region no fix voter roads ah uh, you guys have started a campaign like that eh hey, the voter road then be bad rough ah uh, who is For- the voter regional minister um that one me i see him on social media people they talk him say yeah because maybe they know this you know i just want make people them mind come top say okay. yeah this be the campaign where we start for voter okay. in the rules might be fixed. all right so i'm giving yeah, you so. one minute talk to the voter regional minister let's send a message to him boss please my name is jj gonami mm-hmm. and i'm representing voter region mm-hmm. please boss our roads are very bad and we need help in the region we need good roads mm-hmm. in our region mm-hmm. you know please help us boss Mm, you don't know his name. Mr. Masi, please Google and get me his name, the voter regional minister, so that we can attach his name to this message coming from um, JJ Gonami to him. That the people in the voter region are saying that their roads are in bad condition. Our regional minister, please help them to fix them. Else, if he doesn't, what would you do? Oh, no, we, we keep begging. <laughs> we will keep on begging because we can't fight. Oh. You know, we just have to cool down and wait for them to fix it. But ah. we really need good roads in oh, both okay. regions. Our roads are okay. very bad. But if it comes to voting and they don't do the roads, oh, then they that? vote. Ah, vote region, no. then they vote too. Uh, no, what I mean is, those who are in power now, if it comes to voting and they don't fix the roads, would you still vote for them? You know, you can't change it. You know, maybe you see me. Ah, you know, people can't change it. No, like we we can't we can't we can't fight the thing. We will always say please, or we will always plead for, uh, them to do the things for we because we really need good roads in the region. Actually, if you walk from uh, Adomi Bridge to Ho. Uh, Abdomi Bridge to Ho Road, mm-hmm. ah, it it be it be very bad. Mm-hmm. And from Ho to Aflau, mm-hmm. hey, hey, Sam, let's give them some fire.